Hello, my name is Nick, and my life is a shit show. It's been a while, guys. Oh my gosh, crazy. Me and you besties, happy new year. Happy holidays, because, like, I wasn't around for those. New year, new me, same chair, same shit show. Not a new me. Really was going to try, but not going to work out. But <laughs> it's not, it's just not happening. Okay, so today I have an awful story time for you. Awful is what happened, not the quality of the story time. The quality of the story time is going to be A1. A1. Why are you texting me? So basically, my bitch ass wanted a Prada backpack. Straight up. I've been saving money ever since I started school. I got a full ride scholarship, so I have a little bit of money. So please don't call me spoiled. I'm a materialistic bitch. We've covered this in the past. And it's like a running joke in my family. And my sister loves 10 Things I Hate About You. And there's a scene in 10 Things I Hate About You where this girl, I don't know what the character's name is. Like, I'm sorry. She says, you know, I realized today the difference between like and love. Like, I like my Skechers, but I love my Prada backpack. And then the girl she's talking to says, but I love my Skechers. And then the other girl says, well, you don't have a Prada backpack. That scene is my life. Um, I feel really with it. Um, so I looked into it, and I wanted a Prada backpack. And they only had nylon backpacks online, and ew. Um, so I went into the store, and I knew that they've had leather backpacks. And this bitch... I didn't even go and, like, tell her what I wanted. I was looking through the store. Right on the front is all the nylon backpacks. And I went and I did a full lap around the store. She followed me all around the store. Like I couldn't afford anything. And so I knew that they were having a sale on the backpack that I wanted, the leather one. And I knew it was 50% off. And she... It was just so shady to me. And so I was looking at the backpacks. And I was looking at the nylon ones. I was looking at all the different sizes. They have like a large, medium, and like a really small one. And I wanted like, you know, a regular size backpack. Like one that'll fit my laptop. Like I don't want like a massive like, I'm going to go backpacking through Europe backpack. But I wanted like a nice backpack. And I knew what I wanted. I said, do you guys have any of the leather ones? And she said, no. Like, just like that. And then I said, well, it's too bad. I really don't like the nylon. And she said, well, it's a core Prada thing. Literal, like, that is how she said it. And so I said, well, I really don't like it. It reminds me of a parachute. And she said, and I quote, well, they were used on sailboats. So that would make sense. So me and my friend literally walked out of the store, like, just nothing else was said. And oh my god, I've never wanted to cut a bitch more. Oh my god, she was so rude. And then, so, um, at the mall we were at, they have, like, a standalone Prada, and then they have, like, a mini Prada at Neiman Marcus. And so we went to the mini Prada next to see if they had them. They did have them. I didn't end up buying one. But I was talking to the lady about how rude this lady was to me. And she was like, oh my god. She wasn't, she was telling you the right information, like it is a very core Prada thing to have nylon. However, she should have never said it to you as rudely as she did. And it turns out the lady that I was talking to and working with on this backpack, and I really, really want to go back and buy it, but it's kind of expensive. It's very expensive, but it's half off, so. Um, but turns out this lady I was talking to was the manager not only at the Prada location inside Neiman Marcus, but she was also the manager at the standalone Prada boutique. So I'm pretty sure I got her in like serious trouble. Um, and Prada lost, you know, at least a thousand dollar sale. Cause if they, if I walked into that Prada store and that lady treated me like I should have been treated and they had that leather backpack, you bet your ass I'd have a leather Prada backpack right now. That would be what this video would be instead of me telling you the story time of how rude this lady was to me in Prada. It would be a Prada unboxing. But, you know, to each their own. Uh, it is what it is. And thanks, Prada. Don't need you. So, I don't know why I have such problems with any brand that is not Walmart or Target. Um, so... Leave me a comment telling me if you have ever had an experience like this, or if anything like this has happened to you. 
that's what an experience is. I'm sorry, I'm a dumb bitch. But, Happy New Year! And I will see you later. Hopefully I'll get back on a schedule and not have a two-week gap again. Okay, like this video and subscribe and I will see you later. Bye!